Hi, it's Tom from Green Shorts, and today we're gonna do a little green tech. How technology can make our lives greener. We're actually gonna check out this solar power port by Anchor and see if it will charge my iPhone 6. Stay tuned. I recently upgraded to iPhone 6 from a 5 and the solar charger that I used to use um, doesn't have enough wattage to handle what the iPhone 6 needs. So that required me looking for something new. It also gave me a great chance to make a video. The solar power port by Anchor um, is actually rated at 21 watts. We're gonna open this up, take a look at it, and then we're gonna find a nice little patch in the sun and see how it works. We also happen to be under the flight pattern of one of the largest airports in the world. One of the things I like about this right away is its size. It's actually nice and small. They also label their polymer, so we've got a number four here, so I know that I can recycle this packaging like that. One of the challenges I have with the current panel that I have is that it's big. It takes up a lot of space. This I could throw right in my backpack, which is great when I travel. So here's our three panels of solar power here, and then a little panel on the end here for cords, and it's like a pocket for the device that we're charging. A micro USB cable comes with, happy, not happy. One sense I'm getting right away is that Anchor cares about customer service. In fact, I've already gotten an email after I purchased this to find out if I liked it. And I told them I was making a video. 10 million happy users and counting. America's number one USB charging brand. This, this packaging side here. Of course, there's a welcome guide here. I might want to read the directions a little bit. Very simple directions. Keep your phones and tablets out of direct sunlight. Excessive heat may cause damage. Bugs may drive you crazy. All right, nice and easy to use. Another thing you'll notice right in here is our ports. And I like that it's inside that little part of the bag there. So it's going to be out of the out of sight, out of the sun, um, and you can stick your device in there. Close the little Velcro closure, and it's going to be nice and protected. You'll also notice that there are two USB ports, and they're integrated. The other device I have um, requires actually there's already a little red light on. That means we're getting some power. Another nice little feature here is that it has grommets in it that allow you to hang it from something or strap it to a pack because you definitely want to optimize this thing for the angle of the sun. All right, so let's go find a patch in the sun and see how this bad boy works. I'll be using a USB multimeter to measure volts and amps. And here's the kicker. I'm gonna try and charge both my iPhone 5 and 6. First, we'll plug in the six. Ah, the happy chime of charging. You note that we're running at 5.06 volts and 0.85 amps. Nice. In slow motion, my backyard sounds like a jungle. Now let's plug in the five. Buzz, buzz, we're charging. Here we can see both devices happily charging and they'll both also tuck away, most of the way, out of the sun. Charging your iPhones with the power of the sun using the Anchor PowerPort Solar. That's just another easy way to be green. Our mission is to help you see green so you can be green and save a little green. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video to help spread the message. And if it's your first time here, please subscribe for new videos every Saturday.